We're giving a, a cover of the song Lead Light by uh, Julia Jacqueline. She's from Australia. And it's kind of a classic uh, sound of a 50s kind of guitar with a little delay, a little slapback on the guitar. Slapback is a kind of delay. And uh, maybe a little reverb. This is the verse uh, progression, right? And uh, it's got every uh, measure of the uh, verse has four beats. Each bar has four beats, but each beat is a triplet. So it's like one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three, Two, two, three, four, you know, three, two, three, four. <laughs> and I messed the, messed the counting up, but you get the idea. Every beat is a triplet. All right? And it's got a little swing to it. Meaning it's not, you know, equally divided. There's a little. All right, and a little shuffle to it. Um, so let's cover the verse. Oh, by the way, lead light is what uh, we, I refer to as stained glass. Okay, just another name for stained, stained glass. G, A minor, C, D, And then there's a little uh, G lick in there. It starts on the high E string in the third fret. And that just uh, doubles the melody. You don't have to play it if you're singing. You can just play the G chord. I always thought that the grass was green. Um, you don't have to play it, but uh, that's it. Uh, three, two, open on the high E. And then two, two, uh, two on the high E, open on the high E, and it, and it finishes on uh, three on the B, and then two open on the B. It's like one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, and then the vocals, uh, you know, are they, you know take over. Um, but what, what we have here, and this is uh, kind of, so it doesn't seem like random chords to you. What we have here is, uh, what the chord progression is called a one, two, three, uh, four, five. Okay. So you don't have to just try to memorize a sequence of chords. This is what's called a one, two, four, five, the chord progression. G is the one. Okay, G is the last letter in the musical scale. So then we A is the two. B is the three. And C is the four. And then D is the five. So, so it goes from chord one to chord two, which is A minor. Goes to chord four, which is the C and then five is the D. One, two, four, five. Okay. And in the in the, the you know chords have their own uh, scale. Like you could have the uh, you know this one works with starts on the G. Well, in the scale that chords obey, the only major chords are the one, the four, and the five. That's why most pop songs use those. Um, so anything that's not a one, four, or five is gonna, not, you know, be a, two, a minor usually. So G is the one, A minor is the two, the two minor. C is the the uh, four. D is the uh, five, and then it's back to the one. That's why it sounds so classic because it's a. It's a chord progression that's used in many songs. 
right? Uh, the the chorus changes keys. Okay, so that's why uh, it sounds so different. Uh, it goes to F. I love you, my darling. I do. But I can make possession, make a fool of you. So the chorus is a F. C. G. And uh, so, because we're changing the key we can you know it's we can throw the 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 first thing i showed you out the window now it's in the the key of c uh, c <laughs> all right but it doesn't uh this starts on the uh on the five of this <laughs> chord of the F scale. F is the fifth. All right, so this is a uh, five, one, and then it goes to G, which is the uh, the four chord. C, so it's C, D, E, F. Okay, so we get the C, it starts on the F, and then we get the G is the fifth. All right. But but uh, because C is very close to G, you know it's almost. Uh, I think there's only one note difference between the the C scale and the G scale, so that's why it works. So uh, we go to F, C, G, and then uh, I think after the second chorus. You know, it goes back to the verse, and then it goes to another chorus, and then at, at the second chorus, it goes like this. All right, and that is simply F, and we're playing uh, strings four, three, two, and then we go to the C. Playing uh, five, four, three, and then we go to the the G, and we're playing six, five, four. And then the bridge is in D seven. And um, then it, it, at the, the end of the song, it does this uh, little riff again. And I think they even go. I think uh, it goes D, D7 again. And then quickly to the F, and then that's the transition to the chorus. I love you. And they go out on the chorus. Thanks uh, for uh, subscribing. All right, bye-bye.